speaking, it's just difficult. It will take a lot of you getting angry, mostly. Please stop it. Please die. I need to kill you. Like I said, rude! Oh, if whatever. you hadn't killed it, you would have won and been 450 uh, higher. But two, you would have been. Time killed. bonus. Yes, but. At what cost? I think there is a platinum. Pro tips. It's Do an upslash in midair. Do a down spin to spin and charge to. Oh, use use this move at this area. <laughs> I'm done. I got a gold. That's good enough. He says that's Die. all you get from getting a gold. No, no, it's there's a gold medal now. Yeah, and that's something. And it does, I think, unlock a thing. But I don't remember that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And there's more of them down here. Mini games. And also, there are other challenges that aren't in this game that you only get it for through the Dream Collection. Mm -hmm. uh, Smash and probably, I think, another ability. Yeah, well, then why didn't we play this version? Because <laughs> it doesn't include this actual game. Uh, then what do you mean, other challenges? It just features, like,. Oh, challenges on that thing. Yeah, two of them. Uh, it's weird. it's really weird. So yeah, I went 100 percent in the first world. It's pretty cool. Raisins. Oh man, I just broke that door open. That door in the middle of the desert, not attached to anything really. Sky doors. Link. Oh hey, new power. Kitty. You know what other game has a desert world for the second world? Super Robot Wars. Super Mario Bros. 2. And like all the other Super Mario games. <laughs> 3064. Hang on to your head, the whip has a reach. 100 whip slap. Um, Kirby 64 also has a desert world for the second world. Well, it's kind of a desert yeah, world. Yeah, this is this is a lot of a thing. Grab, grab, grab. It's it's like desert world, but also uh, space aliens and those weird diamond eyeball things that shoot the rainbow orbs that I really like. And it was where I learned that you can eat things, then pull them out of your mouth and use them to destroy their friends. Oh, I like this guy. Om nom. You cannot necessarily kill every single thing like that. Um, some of the chompy mans you cannot kill. Depending on what they are. Oh, how does that look mean? <laughs> Everything Kirby does is mean! <laughs> Kirby's choice in friends is exceptionally <laughs> arbitrary. Like, if someone falls from outer space, he's like, I'm gonna go do a whole bunch of really hard work for you, even though I feel like you might be able to do it. And then, like, he'll see just some guy just chilling, and he's like, I'm going to talk. kill you! <laughs> Uh, no, I want to go through the door. I want to whip the whipper. I want to do this. Uh, I can't! I want to kill you. And so what you're saying is you wanted to do... Um, what is his name? Oh my god! Why? His name is... Mega Man. Tick. Yeah. What? I had a nice new hat. But only if there's a... And then you wanted your hot old hot nice new hat. Oh, wall hot dogs. Not quite as good as wall turkey, but they will do. Yeah. No, he's as good as wall turkey. Maybe a full heal, but to heal in a game where you really need it. Wall turkey is amazing. Floor chicken, not so much. What about trash burgers? Trash burgers are the worst. Okay. Hence the name. Hey! In Kirby 64, there's actually an area in the first desert world where those little pig guys come running through some stones and have to hop over them. Oh, these are always stressful. Am I going to make it? Okay, they're not always stressful. <laughs> they are very frequently stressful. Whee! And there are some times where you can get to the cannon but not jump in it in time numerous times. And, you'll be and sad. it's so annoying. Xander has a good And his name is John Cena! Xander's name is John Cena? <laughs> yeah, Xander's... No, Xander's sword's name is John Cena, and John, and John Cena is also a male sword. Ford, 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 the Ford, 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 the Ford, 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 
<laughs> Although I will say about this game so far, it really wants to tell you which power up you're supposed to have. <laughs> oh, I can't roll up the wall. It's too bad. The reward is some stir. Oh, bye, Waddle Dee. Actually, while you're doing this, I'm gonna do some really pointless farming in Starbound, so that way it's not on camera. Oh, hey, it's Waddle Dee on a machine. I'm gonna kill him. Oh no, it's Indiana Jones Land. Time to run away. He's Broom Hatter. You had an ability once upon a time. Oh yeah, Broom that only appears in like one, maybe two games. It is in Kirby's Dream Land Three. It wasn't very impressive, but it was a, it was silly. Also, um. Kirby's Dream Land 3 is the game of passive-aggressive friends. <laughs> Am I wrong? <laughs> uh, it's a game about anger friends. If you pick a friend, you're making your other friends mad. They all want to be Kirby's best friend. And I think it's because they're scared if they're not friends with Kirby, they will Kirby might them. kill them. <laughs> Violently. Kirby is very violent. Although it I mean, also he's has... He is, he's just a child, and that's why he's here. He's the most powerful child. It also has Nago the cat, and Rick the hamster, hamster and... Pitch the some kind yeah, of bird. Pitch the, the owl, bird. Kind the fish, and Choo Choo the... <laughs> Although it doesn't have my favorite friend! Gooey? Mr. Face! What? <laughs> Gooey. Oh, yeah, Gooey's in. Gooey oh yeah, that's he's only player two though. That's right. Gooey only really has a role in Dreamland yeah. Three. Yeah. No, I was forgetting that he's your friend. He's just a different way of being friends. Yeah, he's the only kind of like yeah yeah. And then Gooey did, never existed forever. Oh, Parasol might be my least favorite power. But um. Gooey is possibly one of the best player twos. Um, obviously, I have an affinity for players too. Um, <laughs> if you look at my favorite characters from most games, I really like Tails. I really like Luigi. Um, if she's player two, because well, I like yeah. I guess I like sidekicks. So yes, I like um, Kazooie. Um, oh, it's a mini boss. I like the 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 player two that was supposed to be the main character of Gohan, although he's you not like a player. The, you like Gohan's sidekick? Um, I do like Fidel, <laughs> who is exactly his sidekick in the very end of the thing. Oh, it's Bonkers. Oh yeah, who guards the ultimate weapon? Oh yeah, Bonkers, the guy who is a hammer guy, but he also has coconut power. Yeah, this is supposed to be a monkey or something. He almost looks like he's a. He just looks like a guy wearing a helmet. A helmet? I thought that was his hair. Anyway, he's dead, so I'm gonna steal his weapon. Yeah, no. To me, it looks like he's a guy wearing a wife beater and a helmet. All right. So how do you throw your hammer so I know how to not throw it? Okay. Yeah, because if you throw your hammer, it's it gone. does a lot of damage, it's but you can only do it once, and you lose your ability forever. Well, to give another hammer. No, forever. Hammer is very hard to find again. It's pretty much and only where it tells. And the hammer flip, you. which is just the most powerful thing that isn't the hammer throw. Oh, the uppercut. Yeah, I don't know why uppercutting someone with a hammer is so much stronger than just whacking them with it regular like. But oh yeah, there's that pointless ability. If you charge up the hammer, you can swing it three times instead of just you know swinging it three times. How do I get this? Tails, how do I get this? You cry. I did it. You cry really quietly. <laughs> that is not crying. And it can be a, it can be a cry if, it, if it's a sound. Or if you're a Pokemon. <laughs> That's my fake Pokemon cry. Is that Jinx? Yes. <laughs> and then there's um, Charizard, Charizard and Rhyhorn, which have almost identical cries. 
Uh, like, there's two frequencies of difference, from what I understand. And you can't even really hear the difference on the Game Boy. Oh, oh, yeah. You have to, like, listen to a, a decompressed audio version of it on something with better speakers than the Game Boy. Oh, it's this power! Everyone's favorite one to get killed by in that one level in Superstar. Uh, oh, you have a new, see this new ability. By shaking the remote, you can wake up faster. Um, in Superstar, there is a spot where if you get that power, you will die. It's a trap. Oh! Oh! I love the hat. <laughs> Just random floating water above his head. I love this power. I wish it were in more than one game. Yeah, it is a neat power. What? It is a neat power. And it can make rainbows. Rain near. Actually, poison might actually be more useful still. Because you can do this tower move longer. Let's see. Oh, and it gives you a stronger water gun when you're in the water. Kirby can use Surf. Yeah, you cannot use Suction while in water. You can only use Water Gun. Oh yeah, you can, Kirby can do Jesus Running now. Can't you also do that with Ice? Uh, I think so. Because I think it freezes the surface of the water when you run over it. Geyser. Fountain Hover. Oh, what's that? It propels you up in the air slightly. Not really, no. It just makes you fall slower. Oh no, just... Oh, I see. Yeah. Well, that's a funny... See, it's a very interesting looking enemy, isn't it? Yeah. No, I definitely don't knock the game for having interesting enemies. It definitely has some fun enemies. This water crown? It's down and... This is Water Crown. It's a pretty impressive sure? ability, isn't it? Are you sure that's it? Yeah, it's down and attack. When you're not in the air. Hey, guy. <laughs> that guy's like, why'd you do that? I was just sitting here. Ah, here it is. <laughs> Lol. That's not it. That looks Oh, that like... was it. What is it? Oh, yeah, I love that Rainbow one. Rainbow Ray. Although that last thing you did with the, like, geyser head looked more like Water Crown to me. He must die. <laughs> I just love how he just doesn't care. He's just there. <laughs> oh, look at him, he's so cute! Yeah, no, again, um, this game, like, the thing is either adorable or an Eldritch Horde. That's, oh, the, that's new, your two choices in Kirby. New old power, stone. Can you find Samus in this game? I don't think so. Oh, hey, look, friends! Yay. That's how a lot of the things live on, is mostly through homages and stone. I am a dis I'm in disguise. <laughs> no one will suspect. Day 437. The other blocks don't suspect a thing. Also, yeah, in this game, Kirby will know if you actually just regularly attack and so by punching things. By growing a fist. Oh, yeah, and there's also Heavy Smash. Yeah, Heavy Smash, which lets you turn to a larger stone. Oh, yeah, it's the, yeah, a larger 8-ton weight. Weren't, um, the Mario and Sama statues both equally unlikely to find in, like, they were, like, 1 in 10,000 or something? No, and there was the Muscle Dude, which was just kind of rare. Yeah, it was, like, 1 in 100 or something. Oh, hey! Speak the devil. <laughs> Although he's in a different pose than that one. He's more in like a... Yeah. Like a... Let's see here. On pit pose? Yeah, like this kind of pose. I like the old pose better. Instead of the one where he's like, OH MY BACK! Yes. Oh, I turned into something there. Then I turned back too quick. It looked like a, some kind of building, a lab or something. Well, I guess... Was it a HAL lab? I don't know. It might have been. I wouldn't know. I guess I need to do it. Well, we have it on footage. We're gonna miss it if I don't get it again, aren't we? Possibly. This is gonna be an exciting episode! What do I want to steal in Starbound? All the things. 
No, actually, I don't do much stealing anymore. <laughs> You've reformed? Um, the only things I steal now are things that the 3D printer can't print. Like hats. Or, and anything that's in someone's lockers. Because they don't care. Yeah, uh, the only things I steal now are things that a true RPG hero would steal. Because a true RPG hero generally won't steal your door. <laughs> he just comes in your house oh, and rips yeah, your... Oh, there's a rare statue. Hi, Mario. 